What's good, my beautiful people? I just wanted to talk to you guys for a second. <clears throat> uh, I am tremendously sick. I'm, I'm literally on the back end of it. Yesterday, I was like coughing and dying and I threw up a couple of times. Yeah, just a bunch of stuff y'all don't need to know about. But anyway, what I wanted to talk about today was uh, just now that Summer Games Fest and you know all the usual summer announcements are out of the way, man. I wanted to have a conversation about it and I think the way I wanted to do this is going to be a little different than I, the way I usually do it just because I feel like as a content creator or as somebody who makes I guess makes videos every now and then uh, I have not been, been doing a great job I'm gonna be honest with you I've not been doing a good job mostly because I've been kind of like wrapped in the what I would call expansion quest of making content you know i've been kind of trapped in this mindset of oh i gotta i gotta make the most content the best way possible instead of you know just actually making good content for you guys so instead of you know making videos where i'm talking basically i've been making content as if it's a business like news updates and stuff like that instead of making content that i think people would want to watch just because I have now become of the mindset of, oh, just get it out. If you just get the content out, then, you know, people will watch. And it's just not true. Because, you know, during my earlier days of YouTube, which, I mean, you guys have seen, who have been here long enough, uh, you guys have seen, it would take me hardly any time at all to, you know, gain a thousand subs out of nowhere. Um especially during like Watch Dogs, Assassin's Creed season, stuff like that. It was very, almost too easy to be able to get subs. Every single day I was going up 10, 20, 30, almost 100 at one point in time. But I got a little complacent with being able to do that. And then when I took that year long break, basically, you know, with the move and the drama with, you know, other people and stuff like that. I'm not going to name any names, but I mean, you know if you guys have been here long enough you guys will know so yeah that was just something that i was of the mindset oh man i'm good like i just have to make content and people will show up and that is that is not the case anymore uh and then i started to think oh all i had to do is just make better content and then that wasn't the case because then it became extremely difficult for me to make better content because I wasn't making content at all. So it's kind of defeats the purpose, you know what I mean? So instead of doing things like, hey everybody, and being super generic and stuff, I'm only specifically talking to the people for these type of videos that I'm talking directly to you, basically. It's a lot easier to do that. I feel like there's a ton of news updates that I would love to kind of cover and stuff like that but then two things happen number one i think everybody's already heard it you know what i mean there's no reason for me to do a summer games fest video there's no reason for me to do an xbox showcase video there's no reason for me to do a oh kevin hart was on on stream with kai sanat and drewski video um you know stuff like that there's there's no reason for me to make these videos there's no reason for me to inform people about this news or things that are going on in the gaming anime nerd space things like that like there's already bigger creators doing things like that right that was my first mindset but then in that same in that same thought process there are also people that hit me up that remind me or send, send me reminders of shit i already knew which I don't know if you guys know this, but that shit bothers me. Oh my God. And of course they don't know because, you know, like I've always said, if I don't react to it or if I don't put it on my channel, that means I haven't seen it. And which is simply not true. That's not the case at all. Um, <laughs> so, you know, I had somebody message me like, oh, have you seen the new Assassin's Creed trailer? Who the fuck do you think you're talking to? Of course I've seen the Assassin's Creed trailer. What? Oh, did you know uh, uh, Assassin's Creed this or oh, they're coming out with the DLC for this? I'm like, I'm in this space. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm locked in. Have you seen this new thing? I'm locked in, bro. Like, you don't need to tell me shit I've already seen. But then again, 
These are close personal friends of mine who have no, they don't even know I do content. So it's kind of hard for me to, like somebody the other day DM'd me on Instagram and was like, have you seen this trailer for, for Dragon Ball Sparking Zero? I'm like, huh? Of course I've seen it. They're like, oh, there's going to be Daima character. Did you know about Dragon Ball Daima? Shut the fuck up. Of course I knew about that shit. Hello? I'm in that space. But once again, there's no way these people would know. There's absolutely no way these people would know. So that shit just is, uh, annoyed me a little bit. Really wasn't happy about that. So I was like, damn, that really shows that I have to make a lot. I mean, a lot of videos for people to really feel like they're keeping up with me or that I'm uh, on top of certain things because I really don't need people sending me trailers of shit I've already seen like that. I, I don't know why that bothers me so much, but it really does. It bothers me a lot. Um, but yeah, I, you know. I'm just going to continue to make the best videos that I can make for right now. Uh, I appreciate you guys rocking with me, man. Uh, especially the people who have, you know, constantly turned out to stream, even though I'm like, oh yeah, guys, I'm going to stream at five in the morning every single day, which, you know, I'm still doing that. Uh, I've just been sick the last couple of days. So that's been extremely difficult. Um... But yeah, is that, I think that's pretty much it. I think that's pretty much it. Basically, the TLDR, you're getting to the end of this video. Uh, I I want to make more content. I want to make it better. Uh, I've seen, you know, my peers and stuff excel and exceed way past anything that I've done. So, you know, shout out to them. Uh, but I'm, I'm on your ass. I'm on your ass, bro. Uh, <laughs> pause. Pause, man. But yeah, I'm uh, I'm gonna have to put stuff. I'm gonna have to put some stuff together. So, but thank you guys for rocking with me this far. I really, really appreciate that. We got a new video coming tomorrow. Uh, probably a second one today. I don't know. But I'm gonna have to put some of these TikTok uh, TikToks that I've made on YouTube Shorts. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely hate YouTube Shorts. Um, I think YouTube Shorts are actually terrible. They're as bad as Instagram Reels. That's just my opinion. Uh, and I'll tell you why. Because they have no correlation to the shit that I actually like. Which is so weird because YouTube having this like big, you know, monster of an algorithm is able to tell me which videos it, they think I would like or recommend me rabbit hole videos and stuff. They can do that for regular YouTube videos. But for some reason, for YouTube Shorts, the algorithm is not the same, which I'm a little confused by. So yeah, I, I don't know. I got recommended like all sorts of weird, freaky type of videos. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm not gonna say what, but you know, it definitely violates TOS. I'll tell you that. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, just some freaky deaky stuff I wasn't really into, man. And I was like, how did I, how did I get here? How did I get on this side of YouTube? Like, that's so crazy. So, uh, yeah, I absolutely hate YouTube shorts. But um, I know a lot of people who specifically are in my Discord have said, hey, Jay, um, we can't really watch TikTok because it's banned in this country. Or we can't really watch TikTok because it's not available in this country. And I'm like, okay, for sure, for sure, for sure. So I'm, I'm just going to go kind of crazy with the YouTube shorts for a while. So you guys are going to see a bunch in a row that uh, absolutely make no sense. But just just rock with me. Just just trust me a little bit. We're uh, we're trying some stuff out. You know what I mean? So. But once again, I, do, I really do appreciate you guys for, you know, sticking in there and hanging with me. A lot of my supporters who have, you know, been here for quite some time who really got adopted from other creators who you know, no longer make videos and happen to find my channel and stuff like that. Um, and also just the amount of people that have been here forever. I know, I know I carried a lot of y'all through high school and shit, man. So I really appreciate that. I really appreciate you guys rocking with me. That was, uh, never something in my mind that I ever thought about doing or that I'd be capable of doing. So to see it actually be a thing, I'm like, damn, like, these my boys right here and and you know girls too you know but uh 
yeah, man, I love it. I, I love that y'all rock with it. I appreciate you guys, you know, really being there. And you guys have seen me go through some crazy shit. I, I don't know why I'm getting all super sentimental all of a sudden. But, uh, especially when it's not necessary. But yeah, I appreciate you guys rocking with me. We got some more content coming soon, man. I promise, I promise, I promise. Even if we're just, you know, watching somebody else's podcast and uh, reacting to it and, you know, making our own pieces of content. Yeah, we're going to start doing that because I've also seen people who do like the Stitch videos, basically. And if you don't know what a Stitch is, I mean, you know, you'll I'm sure you'll figure it out. Um, basically, where they'll take somebody else's pieces of content and not and not necessarily react to it they'll just sit there and like point at the screen and they're like yep yep yeah yeah i i don't i don't like making that type of stuff i don't like seeing that type of stuff on my timeline um but also at the same time there are certain pieces of content i would love to get out and just haven't been able to so not saying that we'll make that type of content but you know we'll we'll see um and by we'll see i'm i mostly mean like It'll be stuff that I actually watch and commentate and press the pause button on and, you know, stuff like that. I'm sure I'm sure you guys don't want to hear me yapping anymore. But anyway, I, I appreciate you guys so much, man. I cannot stress that enough <laughs> how much I appreciate you guys. So, you know, I, I absolutely would not be doing this at all if it wasn't for you guys. So, you know, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it.